China's YJ-19 has just stepped into the spotlight, and it's not your ordinary missile. This is an air-breathing hypersonic cruise system designed to fly faster than five times the speed of sound while hugging the atmosphere. Its appearance during a parade rehearsal revealed a visible air intake, sparking global attention. But what makes it stand out? In this video, we'll explore the science behind its propulsion, the significance of its debut, and what this means for future technology competition. The YJ-19's defining feature is its visible air intake, suggesting the use of a scramjet or other air-breathing propulsion system. Unlike rocket-boosted or gliding designs, which provide only short bursts of hypersonic speed, scramjets sustain combustion by compressing incoming air at tremendous velocities. This allows the missile to cruise at speeds beyond Mach 5 for longer distances, dramatically increasing range and maneuverability. Achieving this is no small feat at hypersonic speeds. The challenge is not just going fast, but staying stable. The air entering the intake must be compressed and ignited without the engine overheating or losing control. Engineers must solve problems of shockwaves, plasma buildup, and structural heating that can exceed thousands of degrees. The fact that China is showcasing this technology in a system that appears operational suggests years of research have reached a new stage. The YJ-19 could represent one of the first hypersonic cruise missiles ready for real deployment, not just laboratory. Experiments. The YJ-19 made headlines not through leaked blueprints, but by appearing in plain sight during parade rehearsals in Beijing. Alongside other anti-ship systems such as the YJ-15, YJ-17, and YJ-20, it stood out because of its clear air inlet, a visible marker of air-breathing technology that BY presenting it publicly. China is sending a message of technological progress rather than simply holding quiet demonstrations behind closed doors. The parade platform serves multiple purposes. Domestically, it shows citizens the results of years of aerospace investment. Internationally, it signals that the technology has moved beyond the experimental stage and into integrated systems that what's equally striking is the breadth of systems revealed at once. Glide-based weapons, aeroballistic designs, and the air-breathing YJ-19. Together, they demonstrate an ecosystem of strike capabilities rather than reliance on a single approach. This coordinated display highlights that hypersonic technology is being treated as part of a larger, layered strategy for aerospace advancement that it's not just about one missile, but a family of evolving systems. The arrival of the YJ-19 has implications far beyond its engineering. Sustained hypersonic systems compress the time available for tracking and response, challenging radar networks, and interception systems designed for slower threats. For navies and aerospace planners worldwide, this forces a rethink of detection, communication, and defensive timing. In regional terms, showcasing a scramjet-powered system emphasizes how rapidly aerospace technologies are evolving. Carrier strike groups, long symbols of maritime presence, now face an environment where their security must account for hypersonic platforms that travel faster and maneuver more freely than previous designs. This push also accelerates global interest in counter-hypersonic research, advanced radar arrays, AI-driven early warning, and cooperative defense networks. Just as astronomers refine instruments to capture fleeting cosmic events, defense systems must adapt to track ultra-fast objects closer to home. The YJ-19 demonstrates that the era of hypersonic cruise capability is no longer theoretical, that it's a technological frontier that will influence aerospace research, innovation, and strategic planning worldwide. The unveiling of the YJ-19 marks more than a new chapter in missile development. It s proof that air-breathing hypersonic technology is moving from theory into reality. From its scramjet propulsion to its parade debut. This system shows how fast the aerospace race is accelerating. The question now isn't if others will follow, but how quickly they'll adapt. What do you think this breakthrough means for the future of technology? Share your thoughts in the comments. Thanks for watching. Like, subscribe, and stay curious with us.